Let me tell you about San Diego, because they're considering banning homeless encampments on public property. Uh, San Diego County Supervisor Jim Desmond is with me now. Jim, you're going to hear from the ACLU about this. They won't let you do it. Can you actually do that legally? Well, we'll find out, and hopefully the city of San Diego is going to pass that today. But I'm sure the ACLU is, is going to come after us. And, yeah. and unfortunately, you know, this is a good first step, but we still have this Housing First program that allows drug use and, and doesn't require any treatment when we do get people into housing or do get people there, which is why our numbers, even after spending billions and billions of dollars in the state of California on homelessness, it, the, our numbers keep going up. And as you reported, 14 percent in the last over the last year after spending billions of dollars, it just hasn't worked. But it's a good first step to get people off the streets, hopefully into housing. But then they got to get treatment and care. You have a new op ed and the title is Newsom's Homelessness Insanity Fails taxpayers. That's pretty strong stuff for Gavin Newsom. Insanity? Make your case. Well, absolutely. I mean, we have to cure our own insanity before we can help others. And this Housing First program that, like I said, it gets people into housing first, which sounds good, but it has no requirements for any treatment or treatment programs. And you can continue to use drugs and alcohol when you're, when you're housed. So basically, we're just picking the problem up and moving it to another location. We have to be able, especially with the amount of money that we're spending, involuntarily get people into drug treatment programs and so we can cure them. I mean, if you sent, you wouldn't send your child or, or a, a relative to a treatment program if they didn't require treatment and then they allowed drugs and alcohol use. True. That's, That's what Gavin Newsom has, has, put, has put on the state. We can't get away from it at this point in time. Otherwise, and, he cuts off the dollars. And he wants to be the president of the United States. That's another story entirely. Uh, Jim Desmond, thank you very much for being with us this morning. Always appreciate it, sir. Thanks, Stuart. Yes, sir. Got it.